Hello everyone. Okay, now first off, I apologize if I keep snip, uh, snippling, it's because I'm a little sick. And also, I'm wearing this hat because my hair is a little, I'm a little wet right now, so, um, actually it's a visor so it doesn't really help, but okay. <clears throat> um, so, I'm gonna uh, do, um, this is gonna be part of a, a running review. I got seven movies up on my plate right now, so the first movie I'm gonna review is Battlefield Earth, and this one's gonna be really short because there's a lot that's been said about Battlefield Earth, and you know it's all been negative, blah blah blah. Oh, Battlefield Earth sucked. Oh, blah blah blah. But uh, in an honest to God review about Battlefield Earth, okay, okay, it's pretty damn bad. Okay, but Battlefield Earth. For all the bad stuff about it, at least there, oh, at least there's some, at least there's some sort of entertainment quality to it. I mean, like, when I think of a bad movie, I think of a movie that you cannot enjoy, no matter what. Like, for me, the worst film I think I've ever seen in my damn life is Pearl Harbor. Like, I had no joy watching that movie, but Battlefield Earth, I went into it expecting that I, I would hate it, but... Some good parts about it were that, like, uh, you have to admit, the aliens, what was it, um, like, the hairy looking, s <sighs> the, the aliens in the movie just have, like, these really, like, hairy kind of faces, they, they look really hilarious, like, if Chewbacca kind of shaved off some of his hair, and, you know, you know, that's not only the funny part, the only funny part about it is, like, there's other parts, like, where slow, the slow-mo actually slows down on some weird, uh, parts that are kind of awkward, like, I remember the slow-mo slowed down on, I think, it was the guy from Saving Private Ryan, he slowed down while he, like, crashed through some glass, like, I thought that was kind of funny, and there's also some other parts that I made fun of, like, there was at the ending where the humans revol uh, revolt against uh, the cyclos the cyclos they revolve revolt revolt against them and yet it takes like a few ships and a few soldiers to take them down when it when the cyclos defeated the whole human army like there's a lot of plot holes and there's a lot of things that you could make fun of the movie but overall it's not the worst film it is one of the worst ever like i won't lie because the bad parts about it you know the number one complaint was that it was the cameras tilted all the time and that is a that is a legitimate complaint because when i was watching it i actually started getting dizzy and there's also some other parts like the makeup and the costumes didn't really look convincing and as a story it's just there's too so many plot holes like they're look, they came to Earth for gold, but yet they didn't notice that Fort Knox was, like, there, you know, where America keeps all this gold. And there was, like, a subplot about, like, them teaching humans how to, um, how to speak their language. When you, when you think about it, they could have done that, like, a little earlier to speak to the humans to, because, you know, they make better, them better slaves it's a lot of com it's there's a lot of plot holes in this movie but overall battlefield earth is definitely not one of the worst and it's definitely i'd consider it i'd actually watch it over a lot of movies you know just for comedy reasons so it is a bad movie but you know it's not the worst <laughs> 